Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to the vlog guys. Saturday morning ritual. My pet bowl on Instagram. I'll link it here. <laughs> Make sure you give him a follow. We're gonna head down to cars and cigars this morning. So we'll see you there, man. Someone's got their parking sensors on. <laughs> Doing good. Did you uh, register? Yeah. Awesome. Go, we're running out of spots, so we're moving everybody down that direction okay. so we don't upset these folks right here. Okay. But uh, yeah, we can get you in there. I got this. Yeah. What's up? How you doing? Doing good, man. We're gonna park and we'll head, head back this way. <laughs> all right, all right. All right. So we are here at Cars and Cigars next to the Porsche Cayman 718. It's the Porsche 911 here. Uh, we actually, so we got here about 15 minutes late. Did that on purpose because we're getting some great shots with Mike and his Lambo. All right, so we have seen this 4GT many times on the channel. I always love the interior, how clean it is. There's not all these controls, buttons everywhere. All right, car reviews with Alex. You got the red 458 and the yellow 458. Look at them. And then tell me, you like the yellow? Yeah. Why do you like the yellow? Hey, What's up, James? How's it going? Thank you. Thanks for repping the Upshift Exotics merch. By the way, link is in the description. <laughs> Plug there for myself and for Upshift. All right, so you never told the channel which one you'd pick. This one. But the why interior. would you pick this one? Because the interior. Hands so down. So just interior. the interior. Yeah. I don't have it. Are you sure? Oh, because this one's got the beige interior. I don't mind the beige interior, but look, I like this. I like the I mean, there's carbon fiber. Ah, uh, yeah. Yeah, that looks really nice. Beautiful, right? Oh, yeah. This one. I think it has all the same options, it's just a oh, beige interior. But um, this I don't, one looks I don't older. think that you can see. Look, but no, look, this one's definitely older. Look at the red uh, uh, horse on the beige. The beige oh, yeah, I like that. that. Nice. That's cool. That's still definitely be. This one's the end of the year. Sure. the yellow. Yeah. Watch out, Supercar Blondie. There's Supercar Brunette now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> And insert Mustang crash compilation now. Oh. I've never seen the interior. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right, you're right. Really cool steering wheel. It's like circled and then it's just a straight line. And then we've got David's McLaren 570. Really cool car. We've seen this a lot on the channel. We're going to get a ride someday soon with the 720 Spider.
I want one of those. I really do. I know. I know. I want one of those one day. Oh, I would love to it. Basically, you can make it look like an indie car. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You literally can wrap that car. It would look like an indie car from above. Oh, for sure. Because you can black out the fenders and the sides, and then the top yeah, I didn't red. Know what the fuck he's talking about. <laughs> hey, don't hit that car, man. I'll feel that wrap off. If you guys could choose. Uh, the red 458 or the yellow, which would you choose? Comment below. Alex said she would choose the yellow one. Yeah, but I would wrap it. Only because of the interior. But what, what would you wrap it? Yeah. I can't go wrong with I mean, yeah, you can't go wrong with the Ferrari red. Check out the wrap on this 488. Said it was inspired by an indie car with the slender front end. Really cool rap creations did this one. John, it's the fashionable guy over there in the Lamborghini hoodie. I don't know though, there's something about McLaren's that I just I know, I know McLaren's it's like a love or hate, but I mean it's a lot of car for the money. This is a 570? This is a 570. So one thing about Lamborghinis and Ferraris is how wide they are and how sharp the corners are. You see how boxy it is on the back end? Same with this. And then the McLarens reminds me of like a Porsche. It's like sloped. There's lots of curves. More sloped? I mean, they're, they're just, I mean, honestly, out of these cars, I like the Lamborghinis the most. I love, I love the Huracans. But see, out of these cars, I really like this one the most. Yeah, I know. If There's I had something to, about McLarens that I really like. If I had to choose between the Lamborghini and the McLaren, I would choose in order the Huracan, the McLaren, and then the Ferrari. So Ferrari owners, sorry, I just I don't know. I just I think that the, the McLarens have a lot of character, and the Lamborghinis have a lot of character. What do you guys think of that? Like. Brownish, coppery, coppery Gallardo, kind of cool. I haven't seen that car before. We've seen this car many times on the channel, but just can't get over how you can see all the way through the car. And then what's crazy is you got this EcoBoost engine V6, but the car looks like an alien spaceship. It's still kind of weird when we're like walking down the sidewalk here and this random guy is like, hey, I watch you on YouTube all the time. It's I, so cool. I know, he was uh, an older gentleman and he was really nice. He was like, you guys have a great channel. It made my day. It, yeah, that really just made my day. So to everybody watching, thank you so much for the support. Um, it's just so cool when we're walking and yeah. next to cars and people come up and tell us that they see us on YouTube yeah. like you guys. And so. if you're watching, come say hi to us. Yeah, come say hi to we us. Meet you guys. Yeah. And subscribe too. So <laughs> hit that subscribe button so we can keep growing the channel. All right, well, as I wait for uh, the truck to get out of my way so I can get in my car. Uh, the show is over. We just filled up the Porsche. We're going to keep filming today because we've got uh, some other things going on. We've got a photo shoot with a guy named Papa Panda. He's going to do a photo shoot with the Porsche later. And so we're going to be filming that. And I'm going to give a shout out on his channel when we get there. I seriously don't know why this truck parked so close to me. These gas station like breezeways between each pump are so big, especially here in Texas. This gas station has like I don't know, 20 pumps, probably 25, 30 pumps. And this truck literally pulls right in the middle. Like not even close to his pump up. His gas cap is right there. So what's he doing parking right here? Leave me no room to get into my car. Crazy. <laughs> We're going to go ahead and get the car just a final little shine here before the photo shoot. And thank you very much for Manette's Mega Shine for the bottle. Guys, go check them out to get your car looking super, super shiny.
She looks good today. She looks good today. We've got Papa Panda over here getting his shots. Just testing out to see what angles look the best. Again, make sure you guys go give him a follow on his Facebook page, YouTube channel, Instagram. I seriously don't do this enough where I just pull the Porsche out and place like this and wide open, beautiful day, beautiful January day here in Texas. And, uh, and, and just look at how pretty this German design is. All right guys, so we just got done with the photo shoot. Why don't you give them your Instagram handle? I've already told you guys like 10 times today, but hear it straight from the man himself. Yeah, Papa Panda Films, Facebook, Instagram, uh, YouTube, any uh, social media network you could, you could get me, Papa Panda Films. Papa Panda Films, and he does some amazing photography. I mean, your attention to detail was like everything from just the way the wheels were turned for the photos. I mean, you wanted every detail perfect. So if you're in the Dallas area and you have a car that you want him to shoot, we can link your social media below so they can reach out to you, message you, and Ooh. and uh, and support this guy. Give him some business, guys, because he's out here working all day on a Saturday, shooting from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. <laughs> 7 p.m. on Saturday. But anyways, guys, this is the end of today's vlog. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, hit the like button, hit that subscribe button, subscribe to his channel as well, and uh, we'll see you guys next time.